Hello viewers, we're gonna play some more World's End Chapter 2. I mean 3, 3, Chapter 3. Uh, Captain Godwin, Watson, Roger, and fucking Jimbo. We would have a Jimbo, wouldn't we? Looks like you're going to the Shadow Realm, Jimbo. Anyway, we got turret number 1, turret number 2, and L Lieutenant Enoch. These guys are gonna die. There's, there's no way they're gonna fucking survive, right? Uh, well, we're almost done with this level, so. All right, spirit triple plus. Too loud, too loud. There we go. Okay, right. and I think that's all we can do. Oh, we we still got him. But I can't reach the enemy, so I'll just throw this. There we go. And. I think that's it. Wait, hold on. Can't you do something, Tevrin? No, you can't. Alright. Or maybe I should keep him back. Yeah, I'm gonna do that, actually. Confused tirade. That's pretty nice. And he's gonna... do that range on Beckett is so good. Holy crap. That's amazing. He'll burst 105. Holy crap. He's about... He's really... He's good as fucking Oksana. Right? Cause what's her what's her healing power? Oh he does have heal heal burst. Okay, he has heal burst. And then heal surge is too Okay, but his healing is still better than her. Because he has more special attack, so that makes sense. Um Divine Bolt. No, Divine Bolt. There you go. Sixty one. Uh 29, so I do about 60. Oh, I'd rather do this actually, yeah. That's but that's better to do. 102, nice. And we'll just uh actually I want to throw a Molotov at these guys. But I think I should get a little bit close. I want to throw them up there actually, but it's kind of risky. Dun, 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 dun. So good. Like I am not gonna get over this track. Holy shit. Ten skill points, pretty good. Now they don't have a uh they don't have a buffer anymore, which is great. Still gotta wait though, fuck. Okay, he doesn't have deflection, that's okay, awesome. Uh we shouldn't attack. We should not. We should wait till we have Mockery maxed out. Um, but yeah. What can you do? Okay, you can heal. Yeah, I'll just I'll, I'll just wait. Actually, yeah. Confused tirade. Oh, she's gonna die. Why would you do nothing there? She's she's dead. There's no way in hell she's surviving that. No, no, there's no way she's surviving that. That's over 50. She's like gonna die in the next hit probably. Oh, dodge. Even with choking? But she's probably dead. Yeah, she died. Ah, nice. So far, the only smart one is Serlo. Way to go, Serlo. Alright, let's use fucking Mockery. So they don't attack. So they don't attack Serlo. Or actually, no, they will attack Serlo. It'll be, it'll be fine. It'll be fine. Uh, let's run up and throw a Molotov at these guys. Alright. Looking good, looking good. Let's throw a body. No, I can't throw a body from there. Alright. Alright, spear. We'll use roundhouse kick. How much SP do I have? 120 is pretty good. Uh, probably not enough though. If I was using just triple fist, I would have saved about... Let's see... I know these two are cost 80, so it's 160. And 40. Two, probably 200 skill points. And we could have maxed out their passives, actually. Now that I think about it, we just had triple fist. Hers and uh, Reynolds' passives. I don't even think I have his passives leveled up. No, not maxed out. Oh, jeez. I usually have them maxed out, but yeah. Oh. Okay, I'm gonna go up here and dirty knife these two. 
throw a body and throw. Uh, I'm gonna use her to take out the grenaders because they're extremely obnoxious being up there. All right, how much health do they got? Okay, 90 and 92. Let's run up here. I don't want them separating from each other, so let's keep them together here. There we go. Martin, how much you got, bro? We could actually kill him. Well, not her. No, not her either. How much is your fucking SP cost of that? 11. That's perfect. But will she land it? Because I do have some pretty shit luck, but I could give it a go. Ah, wait till it's maxed out. I mean, they're mockery, so it should be fine. Uh. Oh, I can grab? Nice. Alright. Alrighty, I think we're good. Confusing tirade. Misses. And misses. Holy shit, the dodge is so good. So good. So good. Alright, uh. Can she kill him? No, she cannot. Well, it's time to use Holy Blast. Now they're both dead. 25 Zoltex, 5 skill points, and 5 skill points. Cool. We can use a uh, dirty knife again. And then knife him. You're still alive? Oh, one health, really, bro? Get out of here. Alright, get out. Yeah, that's right. Mini Nikor. Cool. 10 skill points. Uh, let's run up here and triple, spear triple plus. And throw a corpse. Uh, lock blast. Lock blast. I'm pretty sure we can kill him with just these two, Oksana and uh, Vera. Or she. Ra I forgot. I just attacked already. Hold on. Uh, you got roundhouse, bud? Yeah, you do. All right, dead. 72 Zoltex uh, and 10 skill points. Very nice, very nice. Uh, encourage. And. I guess Lock Blast the turret. Oh, she can't reach. No, she can't reach. Alright, let's just move her over here then. Uh, you can't do anything. Okay, let's pistol that turret. And knife. The turrets are actually extremely tanky, but the knife should, yeah, it should finish. There we go. Uh, let's throw some bodies. All right, we beat this level like flawlessly, man. Except for the dead, uh, we got one survivor, which is Serlo. I'm actually really proud of that because I never have had one of them survive it. So I I'm quite happy. Uh, again, kind of a big achievement here for me. Uh, okay, stab. Uh, grenade. Oh, wow. Hold on. How much special defense you got? Wow. Well, aren't you just pure tank? But you got no hit chance. Like 90, but we still dodge it pretty well. Alright. Alright, then grenade it, I guess, because it technically does a little more damage. Or not. Alright, never mind. That was bad. That was a bad idea. Yeah, let's go over here and a roundhouse kick, a turret, and knife it. Holy shit, is it tanky. Hold on. Lock, oh, I can't, I can't fucking target it. Lock blast this. 46? Damn, all right, I'll take that. Five skill points, great. Flaws victory plus 10 skill points. What a waste. These soldiers didn't need to die. Didn't you just sentence them to death for mowing down civilians a few minutes ago? I don't think being sentimental quite meshes with that. It's not your fault, Martin. 
they were following the orders of an evil master. Had they not carried out his wishes, maybe he'd have killed them off too. Good, good riddance then. Your country hardly needs cowards serving in its ranks. Nonetheless, you know who, who, well who'd best deserve the blame for their fate. I do wonder how Father fares, and even Rudolph. Hopefully they'll both come to their senses when this is all over. Let's put that bald asshole down then already. He's tried to kill us twice now. It's about time to give him what's coming in. Oh shit, Isabel is hyped to do this. So we got 170 skill points. I don't have Ivan maxed out. I kind of want to get him maxed out. May have to take off some upgrades. I don't know what I'm going to take off though. Uh, break bolt's important. I need that, honestly. We all, yeah, we need all this shit. All this, all this crap. Uh, I could get removable girth, but the health is kind of important. Dun dun, Um, I still have to upgrade you. I, I am taking off depravity. Do, do I want to? I don't think so. Fuck it. Depravity it is. Um, covert aggression for damage and accuracy. And elusiveness for that sweet, sweet dodge. She almost has enough to get her depravity back, but not quite. I'll probably use the skill points for in the next fight after we kill most of them. Because every health point is very important, but we'll, we'll see. Uh, so I would have, hold on, 80, uh, hold on, let me take this off and see the, how much these cost, 80, 80, and then I know this is 40, so yeah, it's 200 skill points, and we, we got, if we t had triple fist, which is 30, we'd have like 280 skill points, I think. I think we'd have 280 skill points. Um, that means we definitely would be able to upgrade. Uh, oh, sh Jesus Christ. We'd definitely be able to upgrade either his Dauntlessness and Incorrigibility both. And, or so both of Zo uh, Zofia's passives for both of these. Or we'd upgrade one of them and then we'd be able to upgrade one of hers. Yeah, uh, fuck. Man, that's tough. Tough to choice, blah, tough choices. It's really weird though, because I have been able to upgrade one of their passives without, like, before getting to this point. And I don't know what's so extra about this. But, like, what extras am I using here? Probably not. It's probably nothing. Like, yeah, alright. Alrighty, so we still have to buy stuff from the shop. We won't need this anymore, so I'm going for the Paramour dress for that 45% of aid. Uh, with Martin's emboldment, that would be 60% of aid, which is fucking awesome. If he had adrenaline, how much would he have? 25% of aid, that would be 65 then when Boldman would be 80% evade. I hear it can go up to 90%, so that's like fucking insane. Like he surpassed the dim man. It's like it's like that's like fucking Ivan learned from um learned from uh learned from the dim on dodging and Isabel learned his knives knife attacks. Uh, let's go to the shop because we still got some stuff to buy. I don't exactly remember what we need. Uh, no, I know we don't have to worry about weapons. Well, except one, which is a titanium pistol. There we go. Uh, now we don't have enough cash. That means we're gonna have to sell stuff. Yes, that's right. We're gonna. I'm not selling the accessories. I am selling the useless weapons. Like courtesan claws are fucking useless. Bronze spear is useless. Belly off spears you you can actually keep it for more uh for more uh I actually keep this on throughout the game the belly off spear because uh, it does give evade technically 
Well, it doesn't say here, but you know. Has this gives evade too, yeah. Uh, if you're doing a no shopping run, this is great to have if you're using Triple Fist. Uh, but we're selling this, we're selling the Guard Spears, Tin Knuckles, the Iron Knuckles, the Flimsy Bow, the Daggers, Switch Blades, Steel Dagger, Refined Dagger. If we get certain characters that uses knives and I sold them all, I'll figure something out. Uh, Hitman Dagger, I don't know if I want to sell that actually, hold up. Yeah, I'm gonna sell that. I, like, it already has so much accuracy. Wooden swords. Yeah, yeah. I wanna wait till we get to 2000 and then I'll check what we can buy. Concentrated sickle, purity sickle. All right, that should be good. All right, uh, let's see. Uh, no. Shadow dread. Oh yeah, that's fucking good. Pre-dress is fucking awesome. Imperial chain leather, who cares? Well, I could get that for Martin. The shadow dress is like more for special evade. And defenses. Yeah, and defenses. But this one has more. I would, I'm gonna buy the purity dress for her. Yeah, all right. Uh, who else can use purity dresses? Alright, she already has one. The hell? She can't use dresses, right? Yeah, no. Uh, Zofia, what about you? I don't know. That kind of reduces her evade. Yeah, no, I'm not. I'm not getting that. Uh. Hey, let's look, look. Let's look at the guys now. Turgid vest. Ah, we have better armors, which gives more defense, and even gives it's even lighter weight. That's fucking awesome. Oh yeah, that's great. Premium vests give uh, Imperial Chain gives more special defense. I actually might get this one instead, uh, because having less special defense is bad. Kinda iffy though, kinda iffy. I'm not I'm not gonna lie here. Cause that looks really good. Yeah, I'm gonna get this actually. Alright, there we go. Now we have to sell some more stuff, so here we go. I'll wait till we have 2,000 again. Not selling the bulletproof clothes. I am. I might sell. This, I'm not gonna sell the sanity suit. I'll keep it. Paramour dress. Royal dress. Uh, no. Yeah, I can sell this. Combat dress can be sold. Thug outfit. Rogue outfit. Stealth gear. Monk robe, Deacon robe. I'm keeping the priest robe just in case. Actually, no, it doesn't matter. But oh, I'll keep it anyways. Bishop robe I can sell. All right, we're at, we're at got two thousand. All right, all right. So we already got his imperial chain leather. We already got you your cloak. You're fine. You, sir. What? What? Ah, I bought the imperial plate. That's right. Okay. Uh, what other man do we have here? Hidden gear. Oh, wow. Okay. Uh, yeah, no, that's, yeah, no. Okay, so we're done here. I, I'm pretty sure we're done here. Yeah, 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 we're, we're done here. Alrighty. So let's look at all our stuff that we got. Here are Ivan's stats. 62, uh, spear attack. 63 claw attack, 100% hit rate chance on both weapons, 35 defense, 40% evade. Uh, oh wow, he can get some pretty high ass evade, bro. Holy, look at that defense, holy shit. Yeah, 40% uh, rate, 30 special attack, 90% hit chance, 
uh, 28 defense, 25 special defense, I mean, 25% special evade. Pretty balanced character uh, on everything. Solid. He's very weak early game, but he gets very good later. Like, damn. Late game character. Uh, Tavern, 52 attack, despite me not upgrading any of his passives. That's really impressive. Um, like, he even gets boss stats. Like, holy shit. Uh, he can even have, look at that, 49 defense. Holy shit. Uh, 52 attack, 95% hit chance, 37 defense, negative 15 invade, no special attack, but 7 special defense. He naturally has low special defense unless you give him the Imperial uh, Chain Leathers, or the Chain yeah, these. But eh. Isabel, 50 attack with her crossbow, 62 knife damage, 120% hit chance on both weapons, 30 defense, 50% evade. No special attack, 21 special defense, 10% hit chance. Pretty tanky and like very dodgy, very good, very strong. Um, she's a solid character mainly for just damage. Uh, Oksana, 24. if you upgraded her physical strength, she'd be pretty good, but eh, why would you do that? 45 attack, 85% hit chance, 31 defense, and 5% evade. Special attack 53, uh, hit chance, special hit chance 95%, 30 special defense, 10% special uh, evade. No dodge, she's got no dodge, but uh, great range, so like, you know, why would you have her tank? Uh, Reynold, 58 attack, max style, he would have 62, uh, and 39 defense, which is pretty solid. He can almost hit 300 health, but if you give him a health accessory, he'd reach it. 50 attack, 105% hit chance, defense 35, 25% special evade, 15 special attack, uh, 95 special hit chance, 16 defense, 5% evade. Solid character, decent hit chance because he always faces the enemy, but like it's not that good. He kind of falls behind, even if he max out his attack, like it doesn't do as much as he did in chapter uh, 2. Just because enemies have more health, it just it, he's not scaling that well now. And I guess it's because he doesn't use weapons. I'm making a guess he's leaving in Chapter 4. Um, solid tanky character. Upgrade everything on him. Probably tankier than Tevrin, which is crazy, right? But if you think about it, his health growth is more than Tevrin. So. Um, and he has, he has fucking dodge chance, man. Like... Ain't gonna get any tankier than that. Uh, yeah, he could get concentration. 25% attack, maxed out with 62 attack. He'll have up to around 90 attack power, maybe 80, and that would like do a lot of damage. But you lose all defense, so it's a very risky play. Uh, Zofia, 65 attack, which is fucking boss stats. 90% hit chance, 31 defense, 35% evade, 31 special attack, 115% special attack, 22 special defense. 20% negative, I mean 20% special evade. Pretty solid character, I mean like, her her range with her guns isn't as good as the Isabel's crossbow, but it does do some decent damage. The only weakness is the accuracy, and her Molotov damage is just the best. I want to try Wine Slam when I get her, when I'm, when because I'm replaying the game and try, totally going to try it. I think it'd be really good, but who knows. Uh, but yeah, great character I think. Martin, 45 attack, 85% hit chance, 29 defense, 10, negative 10% 10 evade, no special attack, 20 special defense, 5% special evade. Because he just came out, he doesn't have a lot of passive, so he's not that good. I don't even think he's good, like, giving him, like, attack abilities. Because uh, he only reaches 53. Uh, he's kind of semi-tanky, I think he almost has the same amount of health as Tevrin. But still, he's just good for the buffs. And Vera... 34 attack, 85% hit chance for 18 defense, 20% evade, 48 special attack, 95% special evade, 30 special defense, 15% uh, evade. The most squishiest character in the game, uh, Casimir is squishier though, but she's she takes second place in that. Uh, not the best dodge chance, but great for healing, basically. And the stuns. And that's it guys, our late game characters, holy shit. Anyways, I apologize. You guys can skip the video, like me, like talking about it. Uh, but here we are now. Let's go. I saved, right? I got a double save just to make sure. All right, here we go. Here we go. 
Oh, this next fight is fucking rough. So here we go. It's too quiet here. Something feels horribly wrong. I haven't seen a single person since we've entered the palace. Be on guard then, and take each step with caution. A, sick a sickening sensation of foreboding penetra penetrates my bones as well. Father? Rudolph? Azu, Are you there? Is there anyone here at all? <laughs> That's King Rudolph to you, dear sister. <laughs> and guess we're getting a family reunion before everything comes down, eh? Father. Rudolph. So you're still alive. Clearly Deerkin has found you useful to his purpose. And he's been useful to mine. With his guidance, Veruna's empire was being restored until you came and messed everything up. Now what do I rule over? What's all this talk of rule? And calling yourself king, no less? My father, what have you to say all this? You're not going to have much luck with him. He doesn't say much these days. Deerkin did something to him. Oh well, he was becoming erratic anyway. Yoo-hoo! You in there, old fart? Guess not, so I'm in charge now. But you little turds can't stop pestering me. Tell me, why is my own army surrounding my city? You go too far, Rudolph. Father was a good man before Deerkin corrupted him. I believe you retain goodness in your soul as well. Won't you stop this? Deerkin's days are numbered. With him gone, we'll restore Father. Even for you, there's still hope. And this shroud, little brother, and all can be forgiven. Oh, oh, you two are so good and righteous, but I know a secret. Those red stones you wield are forged with the spilled blood of your own precious people. What is this, full metal alchemist or what? Jeez. You couldn't protect them, nor this empty husk that was once your father. But I won't be little brother anymore. Now I'm your king. Bow to me, peons. Can we just butcher this little shit already? He ain't gonna listen to you, you know. Please, just try to knock him out. And father as well. Have it your way, Rudolph. Big Brother's gonna have to put you in a headlock again. Just like old times. This is too much. I'll show you what I'm capable of. Who needs that stuffy old deerkin anyway? I, Rudolph, God Emperor of the Veil Lands, will kill you all myself. I like. What, did she? Was she there before? I didn't notice her. Oh shit! So these three guys, or a force to be reckoned with. You have three bosses here, and yes, I say bosses. Like they have boss stats. Oh, oh, oh there we go. Oh, this is gonna be great. I feel like I'm gonna lose like so many flawlesses here. Um, so we have Linden. I guess I should talk about her clone, her shadow. Backstab, 25% backstab damage from the back. And no abilities. It has a miracle claw. Supernaturally shard relic of the heavens. 35 attack, 10% hit chance. 70 attack, 110% hit chance. 31 defense, 20% 20 20 evade. 28 special defense, 10% special evade. Very tanky. Only has 90 health though, as a shadow. Purity Jest, well we already know what that is. We have that equipped. Now we have with the real one, Linden. Backstab damage, right? Physical attack back damage backfires. Most of us are physical attackers, so this is bad. And she also has very well hold on, I shouldn't read her stats. She's immune to insulted. She's immune to stasis. She's immune to constrained, which we have no use for that. Immune to stun and immune to enamored. Yeah, already rough. Uh she is a Casimir class. That's right, Casimir. She uses blow darts. Uh, if only Casimir was this useful. Let me tell you her abilities. Uh, 70 attack for claws, 65 attack for darts. 110% uh, accuracy with claws, 100% accuracy with darts. 33 defense, evade 35%. Meaning she has pretty good, she's tanky and has pretty good uh, hit uh, evade. 80. A special attack, 100% special uh, accuracy, 43 special defense, 10% uh, special evade. Has opium dart, heals damage while bolstering defenses. Only costs four special. Are you fucking kidding me? <laughs> numb causes numb. Defense plus 10, special defense plus five. And it all. I don't know if it actually heals, but if it does, that's bullshit. Uh, Aspen time dart, pace quickening substitute for breakfast. Six special uh, special points. 
Blown. Attack plus 7, movement plus 2, hit and evade plus 15%. Uh, action points plus 2, 2 turns. What? Anyways, hope you guys enjoy and have a great day. Y'all rock.